Hey guys, in this video I want to discuss the definition of a set. And I'm going to give definition of a set by using logic uh, expression. So what is a set? I'm saying that I'm having some set A and this set A has element X or element X's. And we're saying that uh, X, that my set A consists of some elements if for these elements, my statement P of X is true. Where P of X is some logic statement, or I think it's called like predicate. Yeah. So one of the example of a set, let's take, for example, a set of natural numbers. So we're going to, we're going to write natural numbers in that case, that there is such number Ns, such that n is a natural number. Yeah, and in this case, our p of x is a statement. Our statement that it is not p of x, in this case, it's p of n. So our statement p of n that n is a natural number. So, for example, uh, let's check if uh, 2 belongs to natural numbers. And how I'm going to check if 2 belongs if two belongs to natural number? I'm going to consider the statement P of 2. And for statement P of 2, it's equivalent that 2 is a natural number. And we know that this is true. So, P from here follows that P of 2 is true. So indeed, 2 belongs to natural numbers. But what about, uh, for example, square root of 2 belongs to natural numbers? And in this case, we all get that my statement P of square root of 2, equivalent square root of 2 is a natural number. But uh, we, don't, we know that Square root of 2 is not a natural number, so from here we'll get that p of 2 is false. So this is, means that this is false, so uh, square root of 2 doesn't belong to n. Yeah. So, and this is how we write this. Another example, let's show me, uh, for example, let's take uh, set uh, b. And where b such element z that, that n is even. And you can easily check that from here follows that b is equal. Oh no no, n is even. Yeah, n is even, yeah, yeah. So from here you can see easily see that uh, b is equal to your 2z. Why 2z? Because it's gonna be element uh, negative 4, negative 2. 0, 2, and etc. Yeah, so this is definition of a set. Uh, uh, let, for example, uh, give me your definition of empty set that I gave before. So we define an empty set such that element x, that p of x, uh, and negation of p of x. What does it mean? It means there is no element in this empty set. Why? Because if p of x is going to be true, negation of p of x is going to be false. So logic n will make this false. But if p of x is false, negation is going to be true. And again, uh, the logic n will going to give us false. So we don't have any elements in empty set. And like I did in, other, in another video, I showed that empty set is actual subset of any set. Thank you.